Hello everyone. Today we're going to show you how to create an absence online using Frontline, formerly known as ASOP. First thing we want to do is go to the county website and if you click menu, scroll down to the staff section and we have ASOP sub finder. Once you click that link, it'll jump you directly to the Frontline page where you can enter your login credentials. If you've forgotten your user ID or username, you can click that link. If you've forgotten your password or your PIN number, you can click that link. And if you don't know either one, you need to contact Gloria Moore at the central office at this email address so that you can establish your frontline credentials. Once you're ready, click sign in, and that's going to jump you to this page. On this page, we want to make sure we're on Create Absence. And when we're sure we're on that tab from the calendar below, we're going to click the date we will be absent. So let's say I'm going to be absent this Monday. After that, we need to let the system know if you need a substitute. So once you've toggled yes or no, we're going to select where our leave will come from. You have AVL for vacation days, sick leave if you're out sick, professional leave if you are at a conference, and personal leave. After that, we need to establish how much time we need for that absence. If it's a full day, our work day is from 7.30 in the morning to 3.30 in the afternoon. That is what our leave will cover. If you need to do a half a day for the morning, we still start with 7.30 and the half a day ends at 11.30. Make sure to switch it to AM. If we need to take the afternoon off for the half a day, we'll be leaving school at 11.30 and we still need our leave to cover us until 3.30 p.m. An important thing to remember is if that it is 6.30 or after, you cannot use ASAP. You must call your bookkeeper and please be courteous and not call them until at least 6.45. Once you've established when you're going to be gone, you need to leave a note to your administrator. Just your principal will see this. This is why you are absent. The notes for the substitute will be seen by the substitute that picks up coverage for your class. After your notes, you can attach your sub plans right here. Make sure you save your sub plans in an easy to find location. I save mine on my desktop under sub plans. Then I can hit spacebar to preview to make sure it's the day I need. After that, just hit open to attach it to frontline. When you're there, you can hit create absence. You will get a confirmation number and you just hit OK. If you've done it correctly, you should see that you have scheduled an absence. Once scheduled, you still have the ability to go in and delete the absence if you no longer need it. You can also view the details of the absence to make sure you have everything correct. In the details, I can make sure I've selected the correct date that I'm going to be absent, the correct leave type, the correct time I'm going to be gone. I can make sure that I have the required note to my administrator and any notes to the substitute. I can also check to make sure I uploaded my sub plans. Once you're done with everything, you always want to sign out so that no one can come behind you and change anything, just for privacy's sake. Thank you for watching and I hope this was helpful.